Wes, we're into chapter five now, and it's called the dilemma of a Christian athlete. Mm -hmm. What dilemma? I mean, everything is great in Christ now, right? Yeah, what are you talking and about? that's the dilemma. Huh. Uh, you hit upon it because uh, a lot of times athletes go into sports because of what it will bring them. Uh, fulfillment, uh, satisfaction, recognition from other people. Mm -hmm. And so now they become a Christian. They turn their life over to Christ. Uh, he fulfills them. He gives them all the recognition they need because they're fulfilled by, they're accepted by God himself. Mm -hmm. And now they don't need sports as much as they used to. And consequently, they're still on the team, but their heart isn't in it as much. Mm -hmm. And they don't understand at this point of their life that Christ will maximize their performance as he lives through them. Uh, once they understand that they're doing it as unto the Lord and not to just to satisfy themselves, their performance actually becomes greater. But at first, it goes downhill for a lot of athletes. Well, well, that's a dangerous dilemma because that happened to me, Wes, and I began to rationalize hard workouts or hard challenges away thinking, well, you know what, I got what I need in Christ and I really don't need this yeah. anymore, but God still wanted me there. Mm -hmm. So the answer to that, what do you think? Well, I, I think what you're saying is that I need to spend more time studying the Bible than I do working out. Mm -hmm. uh, but the truth is that where we are, God uses us. Mm -hmm. uh, he'll use, if we weren't an athlete, he used us in whatever we were doing. Mm -hmm. uh, it doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. And so because we are an athlete, he'll leave us in that position, but now he'll use us in that position to further his own kingdom. Because it's God-centered, then our abilities actually become like a weapon for him now. Absolutely. They, they become yeah. utilized yeah. to advance his kingdom. Yeah, in Romans, we're told to present our members of our body as instruments or weapons unto God. That's why we don't have the right to quit whenever we want yeah. to. Even that's up to him. Yeah, it is. It's not about us anymore. Right.